name is Dave Stevens. I'm the head coach of Aston Villa Ladies Football Club. My role is to oversee the coaching programme from the development team upwards and to actually work with my fellow coaches in terms of preparing our team for this coming season. Preparation for the new season has been well detailed and well planned, looking at both the technical and tactical aspects of the game in order to prepare the season. Through pre-season friendlies we've been preparing by looking at different systems of play that hopefully we're prepared and ready for us to come the September the 24th. There's been quite a fair bit of transition. Um, obviously you've seen new coaching staff coming. So Ian Sankey's coming as the first team head coach. Kareem Mitchell's come in as head of coaching and Carly Davis has come in to actually uh, oversee the development squad. Um, there's been transition both the coaching staff and also the playing staff as well. We've obviously uh, had some of our sort of uh, players leave us to go off to America, but what we've actually managed to do is successfully recruit um, a very vibrant development squad which will hopefully fuse and if you like um, add value to our first team infrastructure. We've managed to secure the signing of Sean Rogers, obviously in terms of competing for sort of our number one goalkeeping spot. We're very pleased with that signing. We've also managed to foster and develop some of our younger players, in particular those that are on the fringe and actually within the England setup. But actually also two or three of our younger players are very close, if you like, to sort of challenging for first two places. For me, it was um, a great opportunity that I had to take. Um, I'd got to a point in my career where I felt like uh, playing a bit more first team football was the right move for me, especially at my age now. When I spoke to Dave about coming to me, and he, he was really keen to get me on board and I was really keen to join. Um, my main focus is going to be getting things sorted at Villa, making sure I'm settled, getting in as many games as I can, making sure I'm being consistent and hopefully that'll kickstart with England as well. I think for us, um, there's not been many additions. There's only really been myself that's joined, so it's still quite a core cool group, which I think is quite good in a way, because obviously it's not going to take that much time for us to get to know each other. But for me, um, as soon as I came straight in, I just wanted to get to know my, my back line as quickly as possible. So obviously we need to be <clears throat> as tight as anything when we go into our first game and for the rest of the season as well. Both Kareen and Carly have played for the football club They've actually got experience of both playing and coaching within the infrastructure um, and they're really important in terms of if as a club we're going to sustain our philosophy and we're going to develop as a club, um, they're very important that we start to, if you like, look at their own personal development, their own coaching journey um, and Ian Sankey and myself are delighted to have them as part of our team. I believe I was 16 when I first got my first coaching badge and it actually opened my eyes a little bit to when I was playing because you, you want to strip it right back into terms of where you first started. I think for me it's actually helped my game a lot because I see things differently now and hopefully I just want to promote women to be coaches because at the end of the day there's not many female coaches out there and especially goalkeeper boys as well. I want to try and impact on women's football from my expertise which is goalkeeping so that's what I'm trying to, trying to do moving forward with the club.